so if we just think about this question we can see top view is given right okay top view or plan is given identify the incorrect 3d view from the given answers usually they used to ask about correct 3d view now in this question paper they have given incorrect okay we have to identify the incorrect 3d view of the given top view okay so we have to just analyze so if you think about this option okay so there is one two two sections must be there and outline must be there so originally this is not suitable right if you think about this uh this is okay this one is also okay this may be possible that those are the correct 3d views only incorrect 3d view is this one okay so third option is the answer because if we have a separation or steps like this then there must be a line but here the line is not shown so the incorrect option will be third option okay so yes now let's see the next question here we have to find what top view okay 3d view is given we have to identify the correct plan or top view so let's see top view okay so this section this section then this section l section okay so one two these two sections are okay then this section is the cell shape okay then here also the cell shape ah but uh no need of this line so this will not be possible then what about this this is okay 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 yes option one is better compared to other other items yes which direction uh, we will focus on non-verbal reasoning right now okay following question consists of problem figures followed by the answer figure okay select a figure from the amongst the uh, answer figures which will continue the same series or pattern as established by the problem figure okay so we have to just focus on the figures okay what is the major difference or what is the thing that this series follows okay so here what's happening incline inclination is happening right it's inclining so yeah it's just rotating we can say clockwise okay in clockwise direction it is being uh, rotated so this one here you can see this one this pattern now this one uh, just rotated like this okay again it rotated then this way okay so one two three now this way it must be like this way so which is better and we have to think of what will be the alignment okay so just think about it this one then this one then this one then what is it vertical line or horizontal line or we have to think Forty-eight was so. According to the official answer key, we are uh, answering. Okay, according to official website, answer key is being provided. Then, if you have any doubt in the uh, answer keys, you can just comment down below. Okay, so let's see. This one 
Enter. This is okay. Now it must be like this only. Okay. So according to that rotation, option one and two will not be the answers. Now option three and four. Out of option three and four, we have to analyze whether uh, it can be possible or not. We have to think again, again, again. So let's see. This way, everyone just think and comment, okay? So this one, this one, then it gets rotated. This is okay. Now, this corner, the uh, just move to this then this side then the next one everything uh, the that central line only one option is like uh, vertical other options are horizontal that inner line so we have to think okay so what will be the final answer okay so let's think two inclined is over then vertical then hmm. then what we have to follow the pattern also Okay, see carefully. This point move to this side, then this side. Then what what will happen? So what about the center line? Incline, vertical, incline, again. So we have to just choose which is the correct option. Okay. Which one of these is not a complementary? Uh, this regarding color theory. Then paper folding cutting. Okay, in paper folding cutting, what all things we can see in this particular figure? So here we can see the analogy type of skin. So A and B both are mirror image to each other, right? So C and D also must be having same pattern so we have to follow the mirror rule okay mirror law this one and this one is mirror to each other so we have to make mirror here also okay so we have to consider this way okay and the lines must be hashed this way okay so that is option Okay, let's see the next non verbal question. Yeah, here what we have to do question figure shows the 3D view of an object. Okay, identify the correct view looking in the different direction of the arrow. Okay, so direction of arrow according to that, this will not happen because this line is a this also will not happen because the line then. Then uh, what are links are needed? So this one is okay. Mm. 
the difference uh, the design must be different right for the front view okay so if we think this one then it will be of okay here okay so like this way we have to change the uh, pattern in the whole picture like ready views the uh, options options we have to exclude so this is not suitable okay this is about the direction of arrow then we can tell this is the one fourth one okay so fourth one is having one l section that is here then this one yes okay then the outer portion so option four is the right answer for this question okay then code language if you know coding language then you can easily code each num uh, each letter or by number here it is regarding letter in a code language roman is written in t q o t p then italy is dash italy is dash in code language roman is written as t q o c p then italy is dash so that is a code language then these all things are here sangadi we have to check identify the tie true mirror image of the figure arranged around the figures okay so we have to think which is suitable for this particular figure which mirror image is suitable that is what we have to focus okay One two, one two, one two, one two. Okay. Then so just think. Ah, uh, this will not be possible because you think about think about like this, then it will reach the right. Yeah. so uh, better option is this one mirror image right so which is better this one is okay this is not okay so just think this is the uh, figure right So let's see. So yes, option four is better. If you think about the structure, in whole structure, three. Now let's see. So we can see the next question. Okay, this is from paper folding section. If we just uh, fold a paper like this, and again like this, then again this one, and we have just cut these three dots, then what will happen if we open that? That is question. Okay. So just think about this. If we cut like this then this portion will be also having this dot this dot this dot right okay then again this portion will be having how many dots 
one two then two three four like this way we will be having the whole thing okay so just think one two three one two three then ah uh, two 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 this one one two three one two three and then again one two three one two three one two three one two three this one will be the case okay then here we have to count the number of surfaces okay so one the opposite side two then three then down side four okay one two three four five six seven eight nine ten okay one two three four five six seven eight nine ten so ten number of surfaces ten then let's see glass has low thermal conductivity then statement two glass can absorb refract and transmit light okay so in the light of above statements choose the most appropriate answer from the options given below so statement one glass has low thermal conductivity okay so there is no connection between first statement and second station uh, statement actually thermal conductivity means heat heat transfer okay glass has low thermal conductivity so that is okay low thermal conductivity then glass can absorb refract and transmit light glass can absorb refract and transmit light so is it correct or wrong we have to think okay so can a glass can absorb light okay so it can uh, travel through a glass then anyway uh, this due to this transfer intensity of light will be uh, reduced okay anyway then this absorption happens when energy of a photon of light matches the energy due to excitation of electron within the glass okay so that is the theory behind that then glass can absorb refract and transmit light that is true second statement is correct second statement is correct then glass has low thermal conductivity that is another case okay low thermal conductivity is it true no it is a high it is having high thermal conductivity so the first one is incorrect second one is correct so option one is better for this question okay then if you think about this we have to complete the series right we have to complete the series so this became this more this then this then top so only one item is there okay so this will be the thing then two 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 then again two yes okay then this is also moving this option four is the correct answer now let's see identify the mirror image of the object of the given uh, uh, given word okay so s mirror image okay double s is the double s double s e c c u s so option one that is a better one now we have to place the figure here okay which of the figure will be suitable for this place 
so the triangle is being reduced again if a triangle is reduced then what will happen in a row this being reduced right outer square then again outer square is gone then again this square is also gone like that circle then only the central part will be there so that is option d okay now let's see we can focus on nonverbal part in the figure mentioned below find the missing series okay so it must be overlap right it must be overlap better we can choose this two squares are there it can be overlap yeah and if you think about this just think about it which is better option okay just think and comment below So let's see. This section, this section. So that is here. Then the central portion is okay. We have to find the view okay front view that is the thing then this is the okay it's okay so option one is okay compared to others okay then let's see yes if you think about this folding and folding again cutting and folding topic so let's see we have folded like this then to this and to this and we just cut this and what will happen it will reflect this side also right triangle then dot okay then again same here also same thing will happen so let's see So, which is suitable for that? This one, this one, this one, this one, this one. Yes, better this. This better, right? Yes. Corner, corner. Option B. Now, we have to find number of triangles in this figure. So, we have to see how many triangles are there in the base. One, two. Three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay. Then we will write one here. Then one plus two, three. Three plus three, six. Six plus four, ten. Then we will eliminate this one. Then we will take this. This one. We will. Uh, eliminate and we will take this so what is the summation here what is the summation one two uh, three plus three six six plus four ten then again if you think about this so one plus two plus three plus four that is the then we have to add one we will put one plus two three three plus three six six plus four ten like that we can write right one two three four so here we can see uh, in counting principle or counting of uh, triangles we can see a particular pattern okay so that I will show yeah here if we have four items one two three four then 
we have to consider hmm, what all things 1 plus 3 plus 6 plus 10 so what all things we have to add 1 2 3 4 if we add we will get 10 if we add 1 plus 3 plus 6 plus 10 then we will get 20 okay then along with that okay along with this 20 we have to add the 6 and 1 so finally we will get 27 as the answer okay so option 1 is the correct answer 27 is the right answer okay now let's see this one so identify the correct view so in this direction we have to think L shape is there, this is there, this is okay, then this one is okay, yes, okay, then okay, top view. I know the correct elevation when you look into the object from the marked arrow side of the plan of the object. Okay, plan is given. We have to identify this particular thing. Okay, anyway, if this is the section, then we have to think like so there will be a line like this this one, this one, so this one, this one. So that center line is not given in any of the other options. So we have to take this. Okay, then according to this circles, also it, this is better, it looks better compared to other options. Now Let's see other non-verbal question. Yeah, here what we have to do. In the question, figure is cut into two pieces. Which of the answer figures complete the question figure? Okay, so like that we have to just combine two items, right? So which of the items should be combined in order to get the given structure? If the question figure is cut into two parts, okay, that is what we have to think. So, if we cut like this, then what will happen? One, two, yes, no, just think. Just look at all options. This looks better. This is okay. And if we think this cut, so we have to think again. Um, ah, otherwise, we can take like this. That is better. Okay, how? Like this. If you think like that, this is okay, then this lower portion is also okay. So, option 3 is a better option. Okay. Now, again, appropriate top view. We have to identify the top view. Okay. So, if we think about top view, this is okay, this is okay, then this portion is okay. This one is okay, this one is okay. Done. Now, if we compare the other options, it is better to choose this, right? Yeah. Okay. So better option if you think this is okay this one then this one this one okay then this portion is okay this way this way yeah okay so option one
so these are the norm normal questions we discussed already right okay now let's see the next one analogy there is a relation between this and this right we have to identify a similar relationship like that so here this line is a mirror image so like that if you think f then it must be like this then this line remains the same so it will be like this then n this water image so it will be like w yes okay so third option okay so i hope you understood this uh normal reasoning question